Hello, welcome to Arvind Singh Academy. Uh, we are discussing conic section and this is the lecture number 3. I hope you have already watched part, uh, part 1 to 2 before watching this part 3. In this lecture, we are going to discuss some problems on circles. Uh, in previous lecture, uh, as you know, we have discussed the concept about the circle. And in this lecture, we will uh, discuss about uh, the, some problems along with some theory as well. So we are going to discuss today about the general equation of circle first and thereafter we will discuss some problems. General equation of circle, what is that? So general equation of circle is what? So general equation of circle is described as the general equation of circle. General equation of circle. Equation of circle. Right? So what is this general equation of circle? The general equation of circle H, the general equation of circle H, general equation of circle H, equation of circle H, x, x square plus y square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c equal to 0 with center, with center at minus g minus f and radius h under root g square plus f square minus c this is called the center and radius of the circle so we can uh, write this the center is g square plus f square minus c how we can do that um, let us deal with this center is g square plus f square minus c so Right. and uh, center is here so g square plus f square minus c uh, this can be uh, written as what we did earlier but uh, let us transform them x square plus y square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c plus g square plus f square and minus g square minus f square is equal to 0 can be written. So this can be rewritten as x square plus 2gx plus g square plus y square plus 2fy plus f square and this g square f square will come this side g square plus f square and c will come this side this can be written like this. Now this is nothing else but x square plus g whole square x plus g whole square this is y plus f whole square is equal to this can be written as under root g square plus f square minus c whole square right so comparing with now comparing with comparing with with x minus h whole square plus y minus k whole square is equal to r square we have h is equal to minus g the center is minus g minus f and radius r is radius r is nothing else but under root g square plus f square minus c so that will be also and uh, that will be the proof of this so this is the general equation of circle now let us solve some questions related to it and uh, Although the previous questions what we have discussed that can be also deal with this one but uh, uh, now let us solve some other questions related to this with this uh, concept. So we are discussing exercise 11.1 and the question is here and the first question is find the equation of circle question find the equation of circle find the equation of circle passing through the equation of circle equation of circle passing through passing through passing through the points the points passing through the points 4 comma 1 and 6 comma 5 
and which center is on the line and which center is on the line center is on the line on the line 4x plus y is equal to 16 4x plus y is equal to 16 this is the question and that we have to discuss so we can write here uh, that let the equation of circle be solution can be written like solution let the equation of circle is equation of circle is x square plus y square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c is equal to 0 with center c is equal to 0 with center plus c is equal to 0 which center is center is minus g minus f right now since center lies on this line since center lies on this line since center minus g minus f lies on the line on the line 4x plus y is equal to 16 therefore it must satisfy the equation therefore it satisfy the equation satisfy the equation and therefore this will be minus 4g minus a is equal to 16 or we can write here this employee f is equal to f is equal to minus 4g minus 16 that can be written isn't it this is a first one this is can be written as first now uh, since one is the equation of circle what we have assumed here this is the first equation this one is passes through circle is passes through 4 1 and 6 5 and therefore both of them will satisfy the equation since one passes through since circle x square plus y square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c is equal to 0 that is 1 passes through passes through 4 1 and 6 5 hence satisfy the equation hence they will satisfy they will satisfy the equation the equation right they will satisfy the equation and therefore what will happen for putting x is equal to 4 4 square is 16 this will be 4 square plus 1 square plus 2 g into 4 plus 2 f into 1 plus c is equal to 0 and this employee this is 8 g plus 2 f plus c plus 17 is equal to 0 this is the third equation and also 6 5 6 5 if you put them and and if you put here 6 and 5 6 square plus 5 square plus 2 g into 6 plus 2 f into 5 right now plus c is equal to 0 this employee x square plus 2g that is 12g plus 10f plus c plus 36 plus 25 is 61 is equal to 0 that is a fourth equation if you subtract 4 minus 3 4 minus 3 we will get 12g minus 8g that is 4g 10f minus 2f is 8f right now c c cancel and this will be 44 right now so that will be 44 is equal to 0 isn't it 61 minus 17 so that will be 44 now if i divide by uh, 4 it will be g plus 2f plus 11 is equal to 0 and the second one equation watch second equation watch since putting the value of now putting the value of f value of of what what value f is equal to 
f is equal to minus 4g minus 16 and 5 we get g is equal to 2 times of minus 4g minus 16 plus 11 is equal to 0 and that will come up here that is g minus 4 to j 8g plus minus 32 plus 11 is equal to 0 that is minus 7g and uh, this will be 21 is equal to 21 and therefore g is equal to minus 3 isn't it and g is equal to minus 3 and therefore since f is equal to minus 4g minus 16 so that will be 4 into minus 4 into minus 3 minus 16 that will be 12 minus 16 is equal to what minus 4 so c what will be c now you can put in any way like uh, 8g plus 2f plus c plus 17 since 8g also since 8g plus 2f plus c plus 17 is equal to 0 so if i put there then 8g plus 2f plus c plus 17 is equal to 0 this was third so from third from third from third if i put here from third um, if i put the value of g g is what that is minus 24 f is what minus 8 plus c plus 17 is equal to 0 therefore c is equal to 24 plus 8 is 32 32 so minus 15 so that would be 15 c is nothing else but 15 so c is 15 there and putting the value of all g f c in one so now putting the value of putting the value of g f and c in one we get equation of circle age equation of circle age x square plus y square plus 2 g x and g is what g is minus 3 so minus 6 x and f is minus 4 so minus 8 y and c is 15 is equal to g that will be answer of this question so i hope you got it okay now next question is a and the question is question number 11 right now this is question number 11 find the equation of circle passing through the points find the equation of circle circle passing through the points passing through the points points passing through the points 2 3 and minus 1 1 2 3 and minus 1 1 and which center is on line and which center is on line center is on line center is on line x minus 3 y minus 11 is equal to 0 x minus 3 y minus 11 is equal to 0 this is just a similar question another question of the same kind you can do it your own right now so you can try it solutions now i hope you have tried it but uh, solution is again we will try it in a similar way let the equation of circle age let the equation of circle be x square plus y square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c is equal to 0 and we put center age put center age minus g minus f right since center lies on the line since center minus c minus f lies on the line on the line x minus 3y minus 11 is equal to 0 that this it means minus the, this employee minus g plus 3f minus 11 is equal to 0 and therefore g is equal to 3f minus 11 this is second equation now since circle passes through since circle passes through passes through to what are the points points are 2 3 and minus 1 1 
2, 3 and minus 1. Hence, it will satisfy equation 1. Hence, it will satisfy it will satisfy equation 1. Equation 1. And therefore, what will happen? 2, 3. So, that will be x square plus y square. That is 2 square plus 3 square plus 2g into 2 plus 2fy into 3 plus c equal to 0. This employs 4g plus 6f. 4g plus 6f plus c plus 13 is equal to 0. This is the second equation. And 1 minus 1. And 1 is x square plus y square plus 1 and minus 1. 1 and, and minus 1 square plus 1 square plus 2g into minus 1 plus 2f into 1 plus c is equal to 0 and that will be uh, nearly minus 2g plus 2f plus c plus 2 is equal to 0. So, we can write this uh, subtract from this. This is equation 4. And third minus fourth will give third minus fourth. I am just doing this to remove c. So 4g minus minus 2d is 6g, right? And 6f minus 2f is 4f. And c c cancel 13 minus 2 is 11 is equal to g. So this is 6g plus 4f plus 11 is equal to g. That will be equation 5. Now given that uh, the first one equation is given what? This is g is equal to 3f minus 11. So, g is equal to 3f minus 11 plus 4f plus 11 is equal to 0 from second. Right now. So, what will happen? In that case, 6 3 is 18f plus 4f 22f. And this is minus 66 plus 11. 11 5 is 55. Right now. So, that will be minus 55. Right now, 11, 5, 2, 2, 66, so that will be 55, and therefore 2f is equal to 5. This is 1, what? This is say um, 6, no problem, you can write any number of equation. Now, putting from um, 5, from 5, from 5, if you put the value of 2f here, 6g, 4f will be nothing else but 10 plus 10 plus 11 is equal to 0. 2f is 5, so 4f must be what? 4f must be 10 and 10 plus 11 is 21. So, g is equal to 6g is equal to minus 21. And if you divide by 3, then this will be 2g is equal to 3 to the 6, 7, minus 7. That can be written as 7 equals right. So 2g and 2f has been calculated. Now from 4, if I put here 2g and 2f, we we'll get the value of c. So from 4, from 4 equation, this is minus 2g plus 2f plus c plus 2 is equal to 0, right? Now. Plus 2 is equal to 0, and therefore. If I will put the value of 2g is minus 7. So, minus of minus 7 is 7 plus 2f is nothing else but 5. 2f is 5. 5 plus c plus 2 is equal to 0. 7, 5, 12 and 2, 14. So, this employs c is equal to minus 14. Right now, putting the value of gfc in 1, putting the value of gfc in 1 we get equation of circle h we get equation of circle h x square plus y square plus 2g 2g is nothing else but minus 7 so minus 7x and 2f is nothing else but 5 so 5y and c is what minus 14 is equal to 0 which is the required equation which is a required equation of circle required equation of circle so, I hope you got this, right? Okay. Now, the next question is here and question number 12. That is question number 12 is here and question number 12 is given that find the equation of circle with radius. Find the equation of circle. 
equation of circle with radius with radius find the equation of circle with radius 5 and which center lies on x axis radius 5 find the equation of circle which radius 5 and uh, center lies on which center lies on which center lies on lies on x axis and passes through and passes through passes through passes through center lies on x axis and passes through the point 2,3 so this one is a equation of circle with radius 5 and center lies on x axis so y coordinate 0 since center lies on x axis so y coordinate is 0 so solution can be written as since center lies on x axis lies on x axis so y coordinate must be 0 so k must be 0 k 0 if h and k are the center of the circle center of the circle the circle right then center must be that is center is what that is center is that is center is h comma 0 and radius is radius is 5 so the equation of circle is and therefore equation of circle is equation of circle will be is x minus h whole square plus y minus k k is 0 whole square is equal to 5 square that is x minus h whole square plus y square is equal to 25 this is first equation and since it passes through it passes through 2 comma 3 since it passes through 2 comma 3 since it passes through 2 comma 3 passes through 2 comma 3 and satisfy 1 and satisfy 1 right now so what will happen in place of x you will put 2 2 minus h whole square plus 3 square is 9 is equal to 25 so 2 minus h whole square is equal to 16 and that will give 2 minus h is equal to plus minus 4 and therefore h is equal to 2 minus plus 4 that is either minus 2 or 6 hence equation there are two circles therefore equation of circle is equation is either x minus 2 x minus h so x plus 2 whole square plus y square is equal to 25 or x minus 6 whole square plus y square is equal to 25 there are two answers of this question so i hope you got it okay now there is question find the equation of circle find the equation of circle passing through origin passing through origin through origin and intercepts made on coordinate axis edge coordinate axis edge is R A and B it means circle passes through what three points you can think like this there is a circle and uh, it passes through three points that is passes through intercept and here is this So this is an x axis, this one is y axis, x axis and this is an origin 0, o. This is a point of intersection a0 and this is another point of intersection 0. Now we have to calculate this, the equation of circle, 
it uh, this one and uh, passes through the three different points so we can calculate although there is a little form called diametric form diameter form in which we can calculate but uh, this is beyond of the syllabus of class 11 we will discuss all those type of tricks in um, for j but here uh, we can find the equation of circle in the similar fashion what we did earlier at the equation of circle let the equation of circle be circle b x square plus y square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c is equal to 0 right and uh, that is since it passes through 0 0 since it passes through since 1 passes through passes through 0 0 a 0 and 0 b therefore c is equal to 0 because 0 0 passes then c is equal to 0 and uh, if a 0 a 0 will satisfy then what will happen uh, a square plus 0 square plus 2 g a plus c is equal to 0 and therefore um, a square 2 g a 2 g a plus c plus a square is equal to 0 this is the question second and uh, c is, because c is 0 since c is 0 so let me write this since c is also 0 and therefore what will happen this employee a square plus 2 g a is equal to 0 since a is not equal to 0 and therefore we can cancel a a into a plus 2 g let me write denominator and therefore this employee a into a plus 2 g is equal to 0 and this employee 2 g is equal to minus a since a is not equal to 0 and therefore 2 g is equal to minus a. similarly 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 uh, if 0 b will satisfy then 0 square plus b square plus 2 g into 0 plus b square plus c is equal to 0 this employee b into to f b plus c is equal to 0 similarly b is equal to 0 b into b plus 2 f is equal to 0 since c already 0 and therefore um, 2 f is equal to minus b since b is not equal to 0 they are intercept na? so intercepts cannot be 0 otherwise circle will be point circle so putting the value of g f and c in 1 now putting the value of putting the value of g f and c in 1 we will get we get the circle is x square plus y square 2g is minus x minus by is equal to 0 that in which is the required equation which is the required equation required equation okay equation of circle now the next question that i can take here is what question is find the equation of circle equation of circle with center at which center at center is at 2 comma 2 and passes through 4 comma 5 passes through 4 comma 5 right so here is a circle you can uh, do this say this is the circle center is somewhere like this right and uh, passes through 4 comma 5 center it this and pass it through 4 comma 5 so what will happen center is 2 comma 2 so equation of circle center is 2 comma 2 and pass it through 4 comma 5 so the distance between these two will be the radius isn't it the distance between o to p is a radius and this is what radius so radius square is also equal to 4 minus 2 whole square and therefore equation of circle age equation of circle age x minus 
h whole square plus y minus x minus h whole square plus y minus k whole square is equal to r square and that will be nothing else but uh, that will be x minus 2 whole square plus y minus 2 whole square and r square is 4 minus 2 whole square plus 5 minus 2 whole square. This is nothing else. This employee x square plus y square minus 4x minus 4y 4 plus 4 is 8 this side and this will be 4 minus 2 2 square that is 4 and 3 square that is 9. 9 plus 4 is 13. So that will come here this side 13. So it minus 13 is minus 5. So you can write it minus 5 is equal to 0 which is the required displacement circle which is required equation of circle. Okay. So that can be calculated. Now one more question is there and that I would like to discuss here. Question before discussing this question, I would like to give a concept that what is concept? A point, position of a point. The topic is position of a point. Position of a point with respect to circle. With respect to circle. Position of point with respect to circle. So a point x1, y1 x1 y1 is large inside inside outside or on the circle x square plus y square is equal to a square according as according as x1 square plus y1 square minus a square is less than 0, equal to 0 or less than 0, greater than 0 and equal to 0 respectively. Less than 0, x1 square plus y1 square minus a square greater than 0 and x1 square plus y1 square minus a square is equal to 0. Okay. Then, so inside if it will be inside then it must be less than 0 if it is outside then it must be greater than 0 and if on the circle then it must be equal to 0 so here is a question and that question is question number 15 question number 15 is there and they are asking does the point does the point minus 2.5 minus 2.5 and 3.5 lie inside outside outside or on the circle on the circle x square plus y square is equal to 25 right so we will put the value of x in place of x you will put x1 so here in place of x, if I put 2.5 whole square plus 3.5 whole square minus 25, h what? h, nothing else but this is 5 by 2 whole square, 2.5 whole square is uh, that is equal to um, minus 6.25, 6 not minus but 6.25 and that will be 12.25. 25 right and minus 25 which is less than 0 definitely it will be less than 12 plus 6 18.5 and minus 25 25 is more less than 0 and therefore uh, this point lies therefore minus 2.5 and 3.5 lies inside of the circle inside of the circle which circle x square plus y square is equal to 20 that is answer right now so i hope uh, you got all these questions right now and enjoy it also right now right okay so that's all in this class and we will see you again in the next session till then bye bye god bless